deep. We're already 35 minutes deep in this. We only hit two topics. Uh, UFC 251 preview for this weekend. Because I'm not going to be on the show the next two days, and I love UFC, I told Chris I wanted to hit on this today. So I can go on and get my picks out and whatnot. And that way Chris doesn't have to worry about talking about it. Chris likes watching it. He doesn't really discuss, uh, you know, what the guys are, any of the whatever. But he does enjoy the stars. Wait, say what? I know the stars. Yeah, you know the stars. Yeah, you're you're the you're the uh, I'm the casual fan. No. Casual and fan. there's some dudes yeah. I really like that I know that aren't stars, but I I find them very likable. Yes. Oh, absolutely. And there are several stars on this bill this That's Saturday night. One. I'm I am in on this one. I will be oh, yeah. purchasing this one. So the main event, of course. Well, you know what? Let's let's just talk about the full main event. We'll move from the first fight on through. There's five of them. Uh, Amanda Rebus against Paige Van Zant. Rebus is like minus a thousand. You can find her at minus seven fifty, minus eight hundred. You yeah, know, she's it, a pretty monstrous favorite. Yeah, it, if you're going to bet it, just bet her on a parlay with something else because it, Paige Van Zant, while very attractive and obviously really well known because she's a model as well as a UFC fighter, I don't think Van Zant has much of a chance in this one. Amanda Rebus is going to destroy her. I believe if 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 Van Zant wins this fight. Like, nobody had it. I mean, there's just no way. Because I, I don't see how she matches up in this at all. Uh, Mike said, I'm with Chris. I enjoy watching two people beat the hell out of each other, but don't know much about it. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Joseph said, Rebus's number is skyrocketing. It was 6-1. to one. Yeah, 6-1 to one was a steal. Yes, an absolute if you, steal. If you got mine a 600, or, uh, yeah, you, you're doing fine. Plus yeah. 600, you're doing fine. Uh, Jessica Andrada against Rose Namajunas. Look. Rose got slammed. Like, a, un, Jessica beat her the first go-round, right, and, and got the belt from her. And then you got to see Andrada <laughs> and, uh, who is it, Wajang? <laughs> who, bless you. Uh, you got right. to see that fight happen, and Andrada lost the belt. Now she's going back up against Rose Namajunas. This is Namajunas' chance to come back, get some revenge and whatnot. Namajunas is like minus 200 in this fight. And I think, like, she looked like the better fighter and just got caught in that first fight. So, I'm going with Rose. I'm going with the favorite. I know she's minus 200, but I think that money is worth it. You know, you put down 20 bucks to win back 10, whatever. I, that's what I'm going to do. Uh, Peter Yan against Jose Aldo against, uh, or for the, uh, the vacant bantamweight title. Aldo is, like, plus 200. He has lost two in a row. He has not won a single fight at bantamweight. He moved down. Uh, to to this division, Peter Yan is unfreaking real. I mean, he is in the he's at the peak of his ability right now, and I ain't betting against him. He's he's like minus two forty, somewhere between like minus two fifteen and minus two sixty, wherever you can get it at the best price. I'm gonna take Yan. Uh, he he's the better fighter, and he's on like a six fight winning streak right now. I mean, he's killing it. Aldo two fight losing streak. But after Cejudo dropped out, gave up the title, they had to put together something that would be entertaining, whatever. Uh, Joseph said, Rose lost because she wanted to win by head kick for a round and a half and then got caught in a slam. Yeah, 100%. I mean, that, that hurt. That was a brutal, nasty knockout. It just, oh, it was awful. Uh, Damien said, damn it, anything at this point is better than watching the bull crap that Vince McMahon gives us. <laughs> yeah, I mean, look, we, we used to enjoy WWE. They're struggling. Um, They're struggling bad. Yeah, I mean, the... I mean, their numbers are up. It's because so, there's nothing else to there's watch. There's nothing else to watch. So, uh, the second to last fight, Alexander Volkanovsky against Max Holloway. They've already fought once. Volkanovsky won the first one. He came out uh, looking good early. And then Holloway, who is typically the, the fast starter, uh, kind of faded in that first one. Uh, you know, Volkanovsky minus 220. Holloway, you know, everybody loves him. But if you listen to the things that he said he has not gotten to grapple. He has not gotten to actually uh, strike anybody in his workouts. They've had to do all their workouts through Zoom. He hasn't had any actual physical contact. He thinks he's going to be fine. He said it's the best, uh, the best camp that he's had. I don't know how you could possibly say that because you haven't gotten to spar with anybody. I, it it kind of freaks me out a little bit. So that, that's I, that's coach speak. That's coach speak. Yeah. That's just that's just something that fighters say. It's the best. Nobody's ever. Have you ever heard a fighter before a big fight say, "Oh, I'm coming off the worst camp ever." <laughs> no, you I'm not ready at all. <laughs> this is going to be shit. 
Yeah. Now you're, but we you're see them walk out there and look just so unprepared, right? Yeah. Yeah. That, so that's just coach speak. That's just these dudes are not really intelligent most of the time, and they just know how to speak in cliches. Yeah. Um, I will. I'll say this. Uh, I. I'll say this. I think Volkanovski is an incredible fighter. I think he wins this one easily. I love Max Holloway. The, the I do, blessed I do, I like one, Max as they say. Too, and I'd, I'd like to see Max win. Yeah. I, I just don't know that I'm, I'm with you. He's just not, he just can't be ready for this fight. No, there's, there's just no way. So Holloway won the final two rounds in their first fight. But I, I'm telling you, I'm, I'm rolling Volkanovski all the way here. I, I think that he will be better prepared. I think that he is a better fighter. Um, I mean, you know. I'd like to see the odds. If I can get good enough odds, I'll, I'll take a dog. I'll take Max. So, well, Max, right now, anywhere from plus 160 to plus 200, uh, somewhere in between there. So That's not good enough. No, it's, it's definitely not. So Because I, I think he should be a heavier dog than that. But Yeah. Now, speaking of heavier dogs, our boy, Jorge Gamebred Masvidal, comes in on six days' notice. He is a plus 260 underdog. Kamara Usman is minus 320. Look, this is... It, Usman was looking for Burns, who is somebody that fights completely differently than Masvidal. Masvidal, a little lankier, not as much uh, uh, width about him, not as much girth, I guess you could say. Um, and, and Masvidal is a striker at, at his core. He, he doesn't like to be taken down, all that kind of stuff. Usman, you know, he took down a fighter 12 times in one bout. Like, that's it. Like, it, he is a grappler. He is a guy that will take it to the ground Often. Often. And that's the way that he wins. Masvidal, however, likes to stand and strike. And if it's going to be interesting to see how these two go about this fight and who can actually inflict their will more often. Is Masvidal good enough to actually block some of these takedowns? Or is Usman just going to, you know, ragdoll him a little bit? And and if that's the case, I mean, we saw that with Blades uh, in his fight just a few weeks ago where it just gets insanely boring and you're just laying on somebody and you're just, you know, you go the distance and blah. If Usman wins, it'll be because they go the distance and he's taking him down a whole lot and it's just a blah fight. However, if Masvidal wins, it's going to be a knockout. He's He has knocked out a ton of people. Obviously, fastest knockout in history against Ben Askren. Uh, you saw him knock out uh, Nate Diaz. I mean, it, this this has the potential to be incredible. And these two do not like each other. And Masvidal likes to talk a lot of crap. There's a whole lot of Conor McGregor going on here where he can get you out of your game. Usman had been preparing for Burns the whole time. Masvidal has been preparing for Usman since, what, last November? Yeah, the the only thing that scares me is the dropping of the weight because I feel like you lose so much strength dropping. Did you see him eating a pizza on Monday, man? On his way to, like, they stopped in Rome, Italy. He went and got a pizza, and he's got to drop 20 pounds before weigh-in? I can't. I, listen, I want to be on that diet. I, well, I know I don't. No, I you don't. I way too hard for me. <laughs> that weight-cutting stuff is for the birds, I'll just man. eat pizza and be fat. Ugh. That's fine. Uh, but, <laughs> Joseph said, fake knee strike into a KO punch, Jorge, by round three. If it gets to round three, it's going to be, it, that's Usman's fight. Like, I, I think you've got to win in the first two rounds if you are Masvidal. Yeah, so I'll tell you how I'll be playing that fight. I'll I'll be betting on the dog, I'm expecting to lose, but I like betting on a dog that's a striker because all I need is for the grappler to slip this much, yeah. this much, and make a that the, just a fraction of a mistake and get caught with a punch or a kick or a knee, and it's over. Yeah, and that's and and I don't think you have to worry about that with Usman. Like I, I don't think he's that great of a puncher. Um, no, Usman's Matt. not gonna knock him out. Usman's gonna tap him out. Or win, a, or win in the card, but Usman's going to tap him out or win in the card. Joseph said he was 190 on July 4th. Yeah. I mean, I guess the knockout is, a, if he chokes him out, it's a knockout. But that's, yeah, Well, it's a, that would be a, a submission. So, but, uh, oh, Matt, yeah, that is so great as a submission, not a knockout. Yeah, uh, Matt said those guys can drop 20 to 30 pounds in just a few days. They know how to do it fast. And he said, take a bunch of salt and then flush it. Yeah, but yeah the that's weight is, cut. is dropping all that weight. How do you drop it while eating pizza? That's a fantastic question. Like, I know the scientific way of doing it, but putting a bunch of carbs and dairy in your body... That don't help. Is, doesn't seem like 
all the doctors that have been talking to me are full of shit. If I wanted a pizza from Rome, Italy, I would probably wait until after the fight. Maybe that's just me. I don't but know, man. I, cheers to him, though. Cheers to is him. Is the Roma so, done in Italy? Has it just ran through that place? Can I go there? I think so. Right now. I think I think you can go there. I think it's good. I mean, who knows? I bet it's cheap, too. I bet it's real he, cheap. He went and got... Uh, the, Damien said this fight is going to finish like McGregor and Cowboys fight. And I don't think so. I, don't I hope so. not. That was rough. I mean, that was 40 seconds. And it, and it was entertaining, it was but it was, you know, whatever. Right, so, listen, if it, if, it, if it ends in 40 seconds, I won some money. I, I will say this. I, I, I would have won some money if it ends in 40 seconds. I would... I typically go with the the guy that takes it to the ground. I, you I know, know, it's harder to defend. I, I typically go with Usman. I'm going to bet on Masvidal because I like the plus 260 here. That's but surprised. but I'm not going to put a whole lot on it, and I'm just going to have fun watching it. with the striker. Yeah. It's just fun for me, okay? This is, yeah. fun. This is, this is fun for me. If I, I got a job, okay? I've been working the damn job for four months straight without a day off, all right? I worked 4th of July. I've got a job to make a living. I need something fun in my life. Yeah. This is going to be fun. You got that right. You've got that right. All right, so that wraps up our UFC 251 preview. We've got uh, two more topics that we're going to hit, and they're not going to take too terribly long. The Ryder Cup postponed until 20-